Hi everyone, I'm taking you to Bangkok for some good food and a great sight of the city. First, I'll check in at the old Siam Plaza Mall. They have a great Thai dessert on their first floor. As you've seen here, it's Thai crepe, which is really crunch and delicious. Vermicelli noodle with different kind of curry is a popular lunch. Coconut milk custard is very delicious dessert. We call it kanom krok. I get to spend time with friends, catching up, enjoy delicious dessert, and tasty food. We visit Lachabal Pit Temple. It was built over 250 years ago during the reign of King Rama V. It was the royal temple where the king performed the religious ceremonies. The eliteness of the architect, stained glass, and Thai pattern art made this temple one of the most beautiful temples in Bangkok. It really is stunning. It's one of the most popular photo spot in Bangkok. We are walking in the area called Panakon, which is an old town as we seen all the building and architecture of the old traditional. There are many great restaurant and street food vendor serving in this area. You won't get to feel hungry being here. We are heading to one of the popular cafe. It's located in the two to three hundred years old house. It had converted to be a modern cafe. A good vibe of Thai hospitality in a modern cafe, which had been an attractive point for the customer. Besides offering a great photo spot. Okay. They serve both coffee and tea with many of the good looking bakery. Thai tea and melt tea are delicious. But the tea set with Thai dessert for the table next to us look amazing. We also visit one of the popular landmarks of Bangkok is the giant swing. It used for Hindu ceremony in the old day. This is a street food heaven. <laughs> Popular toast with many toppings. We make it to Rajadam Nun Road, intersection of Democracy Monument. We visit another beautiful temple, Rachanadaram. It's the place where the metallic castle is located. The top part of this castle made from metal. It's one of the three in the world and is the only one left right now. It's beautiful architecture and design.
and we continue on enjoy all the street foods. We got a cab ride to Ban Tat Tong Road, hopeful to try the seafood ramen that is very popular right now. With two hour wait, we would just move on to other things. Ban Tat Tong Road night market had become more popular with variety of food options, qualities and tastes. This place really known for Thai tea. And I'm not disappointed. Many more of good dessert and snacks. We decide to try fried pork belly and seafood ramen with the base of tom yum broth. Make these ramen very tasty and spicy. It's delicious. Ban Tat Tong Night Market is a good spot to check in and it's only walking distance to Siam Square. Thank you for watching and I'll see you for the next video.